This short video will look at capturing holds in Sitka's Evergreen. Holds are captured when a checked out item is checked in or an item on the pull list for holds request is retrieved and captured. Items on the pull list can be scanned into the check-in screen or the capture hold screen. When an item with a hold is scanned, a hold slip will pop up displaying information about the item and the patron requesting it, including how the patron wishes to be contacted. The contact information may differ from what is saved in the patron's record, as patrons have the option to enter different numbers for contact by phone or text when they place the hold. Patrons that have chosen to be contacted by email or text are contacted automatically by Evergreen. Libraries with multiple branches or that participate in reciprocal borrowing will also get transit hold slips, indicating when items should be sent to another branch or library to fill a hold. Hold and hold transit slips can be printed and attached to the items. Local system administrators can customize what information appears on the printed slips by editing the templates found under Administration, Workstation, Print Templates. If the Auto Print Hold and Transit Slips Check-in modifier is selected, as it is by default in the Capture Hold screen, the Hold Slip pop-up is bypassed and staff will either get a print dialog or the slip will simply automatically print depending on their printer settings. Newly created items or items whose status was just changed from a non-holdable status may not trigger holds at check-in because the item is not yet considered to be an available hold target. Staff can use the check-in modifiers retarget local holds and retarget all statuses to prompt Evergreen to recalculate which items are available to fill the hold. There may be situations where a hold should not be captured at check-in. Perhaps an item has been damaged and needs to be repaired before the next patron is contacted. Staff can use the check-in modifier suppress holds and transits to check in the item without triggering the hold or having automatic notification sent. When the item is ready to have the hold triggered, the item can be checked in normally. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit the BC Libraries Cooperative website.